agreed to the deal with Asgard, why do they blame you? I talked them into their own exploitation. They need their choice. Work or die is not a choice. I only made it seem so. What you just picked up there is pure Spartalfime ore. It won't be of use in the rig anymore, but perhaps our Huldra brothers could craft something from it. Ugh. Father, is it always moral to kill something that's trying to kill you? Yes. Well, there you have it, lad. How did these rigs come to be? I had them built to harvest ore for armaments. Essentially harnessing resources that would otherwise go to the dwarves. You think shutting these things down will help the dwarves become independent? I don't know, but I have to try something. Taking a break before visiting Durlin? Very wise. He can be... a lot. There's another mining rig on this island, brother. Smell that smoke. Why would the dwarves agree to work for the Aetria in the first place? That's the heart of it, eh? You lied to them. I lied. 
lied to them. Okay, Mimir. To the blacksmiths of Svartalfheim, the creation of a weapon was a sacred thing. But Odin just wanted as many blades as he could get, as fast as he could get them. With every stolen resource and mediocre blade, the dwarves lost a bit of themselves.
Spartle find slag? Give it here. Hey, what happened to all the armor we made you already? I used it. Well, maybe try to make this one last longer. I will not. Might be my best piece yet today. Gonna keep it spatter free this time, right? Kratos? Glad to take that off your hands and wash it. And it's covered in blood. Thanks. I'll disinfect my tools. Be safe. The dwarf survived because of you. Oh, you're not wrong there, brother. Odin would have wiped out every last dwarf and Sparta fight. If he could use his skills, no one could. Ymir, how many stories have you told about Odin and Thor? And all the bad things they've done? Let's see how many we can remember. Enough. Seems like... We will continue later. Smell the smoke? There's another mining rig here. You speak of your deeds with shame. Do you regret not allowing Odin to kill them? I don't... No. <laughs> Bet we could swing across that, uh, lift thing. Gantry. Gantry. Thanks. Right.
Gotta be the right spot. Those bottles. I smell fuel. Bet a spot from your blades would cause quite a boom. <laughs> Father, up there. Surprised the dwarves didn't shut these rigs off themselves. Why not you tried? The Einher Yar made examples of them. They killed the dwarves? Couldn't you have convinced them not to? Aye.
That should help. I think we can reach it there. <laughs> yeah, that looks right. Call so meager a task done. A wee drop out of the Asgardian occupational bucket. You must live with your deeds, but do not be troubled by them, brother. Oh? And why not? You were given an impossible problem. Do not blame yourself for failing to solve it. I'm sure the dwarves would feel differently. This doesn't fix things. No. But it is a start. A reminder, brother. That Svartalfheim slag we collected could be of considerable use in the hands of Brock or Sindri. <laughs> <laughs> the air smells a lot cleaner. It's because we shut down the rig.
Back to Thorn Odin stories? Oh, no. Not now. Okay. What other terrible things have Odin and Thor done? Okay. There was Thalmor, the stonemason. Aye. He quarreled with his son. Went into the night to find him. Found Thor instead. And there was Thalmor's son, Grimthor. Who built the walls of Asgard. I whispered something of importance to Freya before his betrayal. Fascination. Ah, but enough of that for now. Whatever you need. Happy to lighten your load. I think it means. I've seen more raiders come back as Hellwalkers lately. I thought Queen the Valkyrie Queen was supposed to restore balance to the realms and keep that from happening. That's a good question, lad, and a troubling one. If Hell's filled up again, it suggests that something's been hindering Sigrun's efforts, or perhaps something even more urgent is keeping her distracted and unable to visit, even occasionally. Yeah. Sorry, Namir. So not all dwarves can do that thing Brock and Sindri do, right? Do they just walk between realms and turn up somewhere else? Indeed, that's a rare skill. I gather one carefully cultivated by some secretive dwarven guild or other. Probably for the best. Them alone doing it is disconcerting enough. We going to Durland? Hope he'll be happy we fixed those rakes. This is the safety office? Well, the sign of hair's breadth away from a head injury up there certainly gives that impression. For Durlin? You have an appointment? Uh, no. 
Has anyone ever had an appointment here? <laughs> really collect on something, pal? Think uh, parading a severed head around on your hip is gonna scare me into somehow approving Estrid's accretion proposal, eh? We are looking for a prisoner of Odin's. <clears throat> He's being kept in a mine somewhere. Some friends of ours said that you could help. Where did you get? You chop her head off with that too, eh? She was my wife. Dina and I wondered where she went after our little coup here failed. Failed? Yeah, come, come. Failed. Dead. The rest of them are. The ones left alive have to pay the price. I'm afraid <clears throat> I can't help you with your little prisoner situation. But he could have answers on how to stop Odin and free Svartalfheim from the ace here. Now, I'm not in the business of crossing the old father anymore. Wait, before you go. Take this. What is it? A fine. Hygiene code violation for improper transport of a rotting head. Uh, two demerits for speaking the All Father's given name and, um, yeah. For fucking up my desk! A fine? Pay it at your leisure, okay? Get out of my office. <laughs> Hey there. So what about get out of my office? Don't you understand? You said her name was Dina? Oh, uh, sure. Thank you. I think. This isn't a fun. Not now. There are enemies ahead. Poison! Right side! <laughs> Hey, 
Okay, as I was saying, I think Derlin wrote down directions. The dwarf has given us a map. Sort of. Uh, you smell him? But it seems to lead to a mine beyond that mountain. Ah. Cheers! Derlin helped us anyway. Not everyone uses axes and arrows to fight. <laughs> Yeah, <laughs> 